Yo, what's going on guys? In this episode, you guys want to learn how I did this? I know it's pretty epic, right? What do you think, Stan? Nice, good words of wisdom by the egg people. If you guys want to learn how to put yourself in any video game, watch my stream or my videos and you'll find out exactly how. In this episode, how to do this within two hours. Let's get right into it. Oops, what's up guys? As you can see, I'm not a professional streamer. So yes, basically if you want to put yourself in a video game, you're going to need a green screen. So today, what we're going to do is we're going to add a scene to my OBS. If you guys didn't know that I have scenes, well, a scene is basically a way that I put myself in my video game. And I'm going to show you guys how I did it by actually making one on stream. Why not? This is my display capture. I'm currently streaming. I have my stream set up over there and I'm able to put stickers over my stream by using OBS Studio. Now OBS Studio is an app that I use to stream and I think it's the main streaming app and it looks like this. Now I set it up in a way that every time the camera sense sees green, green becomes see-through. What does that mean? Basically means that this thing here is a green curtain but when I move it around you know it, it becomes see-through so you see what's going on in the background so first you gotta pick a scene right so let's open up Rocket League because that's my game and let's try to put myself in a scene I'll give you an example of a scene that I've already done here we go so it does have its own audio and if I walk into it or stick my hand out I'm in the game but I actually set it up in a way that I could go from green screen mode to regular office mode which is pretty sick that's one of the scenes that I made let's see if I can show you guys another scene the car scene the car scene is basically <laughs> pretty funny I put a rocket big car here and I guess the sweet spot for this one is right here right here there we go so if you guys want to know how to go from this to your real life stuff, then let's keep going. Let's keep watching this video and let's see how long it actually took me to make this scene. Virtual studio. Oh, that's what I want. Oh, we're using this one. It's called virtual studio. <gasps> Check this out. Okay. Watch how good, watch how good I am. Watch this. Okay. So the first step here is recording the virtual studio. Record it and get it to loop. Once you get it to loop, you can play around with it. And this is exactly what I'm doing here. I'm recording this straight from YouTube. And that's how I got it done. Why isn't it playing? Why is it black too? What's happening? Oh, there you go. So this is the this is the setup that I chose. We just gotta make sure that up here it doesn't show up. See that little white thing that shows up there? So how I'm gonna do that is pretty simple. I'm gonna grab a screenshot. Take a screenshot of that desk. Taking a screenshot of the desk. Oh, I had it already. Uh, dumb, dumb. Go here. Paste it. I'm gonna magic select just the desk. Done. I don't want the green screen. I want the desk. I need all the little bits and pieces. Pretty dope. Looks pretty good. Done. Make that sticker. I need my canvas to be transparent again. Go back to stickers. Put that right here. Boom. There we go. Save that image as desk studio I'll explain why I'll need that later okay now okay let's close that right now I'm 
thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking how I'm gonna do this. I have to put myself behind there. That's pretty easy, but I wanna put Stan back there too. So I have this here. I'm gonna here, pin that back to player. I'm gonna import a blue egg. I have a desk there too. And I gotta import the desk that I just made, the desk studio. Desk studio, there it is. It's fine, make it match. Uh, overlay. You can make it bigger, it's fine. Just like that. Boom. There you go. The egg. It's like this. Overlay. This is Stan. Behind the... There we go. Overlay. Stan. Stan the man. A little bit too big. There you go. Now it's gonna appear behind the desk. Uh, no, actually, here. Now he's gonna appear behind the desk. There you go, so I just put Stan in there. How do I put myself in there? I'll explain afterwards, but I got Stan in there. I'm gonna move him over just a bit. Actually, no, he's pretty good there. No, no, not color adjustments. I want overlay. Move him over. There you go. Perfect. A stand. All right. The new studio with Stan is pretty uh, epic. I know what I'm gonna put in the background. It's gonna be pretty cheap, but whatever. I just I know what I'm gonna put on the big screen here. Like a wake English breakfast. All right, so once you found your studio and you have green screens all over the place, it's pretty easy. Now you just got to put in videos in those green screen slots, which is what I did. I have a video up here, which is the trailer for season one. I have a thumbnail here on the other side, sorry. And I have another YouTube video up there with Stan and Lil 2K recording us on the bottom left. Once you have that, it's pretty simple. Then you gotta select the overlays, put some pictures over where you don't wanna be seen, like the desk here. I have a picture on my OBS studio, so I'm not seen. And that's exactly how I did it. Okay. So once you have that, now we can move on to the, to the part where I'm gonna put myself in my scene that I just made. Okay. So this is what you guys see. See how smooth it is. I told you it was smooth. I made myself a little studio here. Paste reference. This is me, baby. There you go, just like this. This is me. Sup, Stan? What's going on, Stan? Do I make myself just a bit bigger? Yeah, I feel like I feel like I'm too big now. Wait, 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 wait. Like this. I'm taller than an egg, right? Anyways, now I gotta crop it just a little bit more. So I'm there we go. So this is the desk. And that's how you put yourself in the game, baby. So Stan, how do you like the new setup?
I think Stan likes it. All right, guys, that's how I did that. It takes a lot of time. You pick your videos and you put yourself wherever you want. All you have to do is copy paste the image over where you don't want to be seen. And then you can add in some videos and you can add in some animations like I did with the egg and little 2K over there. And that's how it's done. Thank you everyone for watching the stream. If you want to see this live and you have more questions, that's totally okay. Just subscribe to my channel, click that bell icon so you're notified when I start a stream and you can watch me live and ask me anything as I'm doing the next scene. I do scenes a lot. I'm probably gonna do them every week. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm H2K, see you guys next time. Peace.